YouTube, 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 YouTube. What's up, Shibo Original Dog Man? I have um, a video here for uh, my order fillers. All the people you, who are going to be order fillers in these warehouses. I'm going to show you a little something here. I could take a lot of these videos. All of these videos are amateurs. They're amateurs in the pick. Some of them have been working for a very long time. They're still slow. They don't know what they're doing. And this one says, order select a really fast paced warehouse. Okay. This dude isn't really fast paced. He finished this trip in 20 minutes. 20 minutes. I showed you guys my paperwork, man. I would have finished this in like five, <laughs> maybe 10, maybe 10. I'll give myself about eight. I would have finished this in eight because it's, it's, uh, it looks like 50, 50, 60 cases, all right? They're big boxes. So it looks like about 50 cases and they're light. They're really light. So let's check it out. Let's check it out. Show you guys. There we go. All right, so here he's starting off with six cases. It looks like oil or something, okay? Six cases of oil. And he has it on two different pallets. He has it on two different pallets. This is a three pallet jack, okay? This is a three pallet jack, and, and he's already got a bunch of pallets in the front, and he's got two pallets he's going to work on. Show you all the mistakes this dude made. This dude's amateur, straight amateur. He's turning corners hard and heavy, turning them wide. That means going fast. He stops, he's coasting a little bit, picks up a case. Puts it on a corner. Why put a case like that on a corner when you already got six cases of heavy oil that you could have put on a corner? He puts a light box on a corner. That makes no sense to me, but let's continue. There you go. Puts a light box. Pushes the other oil over. It makes it harder for himself. Walks around his pallet. Don't ever walk around your pallet. He picked from this side. He walked around and put it over here. Don't ever do that. Don't ever do that. Turning quarters. Doesn't cherry pick. That's a good thing. He don't cherry pick. Now he puts it on that side. Look, you pick something up on this side, you put it on this side. You, he picked it on this side, put it on that side. Ah, drop that case, man. Put that case on that side. Walks around again, puts it on that side. That makes no sense to me. Puts it all the way over there. Walking around your pallet jack. That's wasting time, man. Wasting time. Tagging. He's, the way he's tagging it, he's tagging it wrong. Put the tags on the outside. He's taking a shortcut now. Okay. Here, here I realize what he's doing. Here I realize what he's doing. He knows that his ne next pick is at the end of the next aisle. At the end of the next. So instead of him going all the way around, he backs up to the end of the aisle. Watch what he does here. So his pick is on this aisle, I think. And he's going to pick at the end of the aisle. He knows his aisle. So he does know his aisle. So he's going to turn, turn, turn. There it is. Yep. It's at the end of this aisle. So instead of him going all the way around that way, he did a smart move and saved some time. He saved a couple, he saved a couple seconds. Maybe a minute. Or a half a minute. He don't layer stack. He's column stacking. He's not. He's not. He's not. He's not tying in his cases. All right. He's calling straight up and down. This is what he's doing. Wow. 
Walk. What was that for? Walked around for no reason. He's still on the same side. Same side. Look, walk around again. Wasting time. Walking around his pallet. Walk around. There you go. Watch him walk around again. There you go. Walk all the way around here. That don't make no sense. See, if that was me, I wouldn't have done that shit. I would have saved me at least three seconds right there. Every second count when you in that pick, man. Every second count. That's why I was a high puller. I had to learn. A, just like he learning, I had to learn the hard way, too. But I was a little bit smarter. I learned fast. I told myself I ain't wasting no energy. This is my wasting all that. And then he tagging everything on the inside. When By the time these cases get to the store, it's going to be hard for the people at the store to, to look at it and scan it. And if he if, if this pallet was going to be audited, they'd have been pissed at him because all his stickers on the inside. Some warehouses tell you put all your stickers on the outside. So you tagged it on the inside again. He make it harder for other people, man. This ain't making it easier for him or his warehouse. It make it harder. Now he's got to find a crevice. Every time he's... Every time he picks something, he's walking across his pallet. Every time he picks something, at least he dropped it off on that side. Since he since he column stacking straight up and down, he gonna have a bunch of crevices all around his pallet. Walk around, there, wasting time. Walking around. See, if he just, if he would have layer stacked uh, straight up and down, and he would have column stacked everything, this pallet would have been legit. And if he would have worked off of two pallets instead of working off of one, he worked off of two pallets, he would have had two pallets going straight up like that. And therefore, it would have been easier for him to pick and choose a spot to put his cases. But since he's working one pallet first like a big dummy, he's making, it, he's making this trip last longer. Look how he's walking around. He touched another case. He picked that oil up that he had in the very beginning and put it in the middle. He dropped something. I don't know what he dropped. He dropped a case or something. Still, still column stacking. He not he not tying nothing in. He's unsure of his of his pallet. You see, he shook it. Look, dropping product. That that. This so unsturdy, man. This this trip is unsturdy, a motherfucker. Now he's got this is level. See how that's level? It's too late now. It's too late. He could he gonna put something to tie it in on top. These two cases. Let's see if he puts something right here. Nope. He don't put nothing in between those two cases. That make no damn sense. Look, look, that shit about to fall. Still, he not coasting right. He's supposed to pass it up. When you coast, pass your shit up, man. Pass your slot that you're picking from. Pass it up. That was a good coast. That was a good coast right there, what he just did. That's like a tie-in, but not really. You see that big, you see this big crevice right here? That big gap? That's what causes pallets to fall when you don't fill that gap in. That's when you know motherfucker column stack. You stack it straight up and down. That's one case. That's one case. That's one case, and that's one case. Straight up and down. Like he got cases, these two cases in front right here, this one and this one, he don't know where to put it because he column stacking. He finally, he finally tied a case in up here. Finally, see that, see the, the gap right here? He got it right there. One case in between these two cases right here. Finally tied it in. When you should have been tying it in from the bottom to about waist high. If he would have did that, he'd have been able to roll faster. But it took him 20 minutes. To pick about 50, 60 cases. 20 minutes to pick about 50, 60 big box cases. 
There's no way in hell. Look, he's picking up. He's touching the case again. Touching the case again. This is a two pallet trip. He working the first pallet on the back side. Then he's going to work the second pallet on the front side. No sir. This is a two pallet trip about, this is about 70 cubes. This is about a 70 cube pallet, which means they're going to be about seven feet tall. Six, six and a half to seven feet tall. He on a rollback slot. That sound like a rollback slot. He pulled a pallet, uh, a pallet out and put it on the floor, I believe. Because he took the last case, I think. Let's see, we'll find out. If, he, if there's a pallet on the floor, he put it there. He's, that, there he is. Look, look how sloppily he put it. See that pallet right there? He just threw it over there. Threw it on the floor. Those are rollback slots right here. They got they got pallets of stuff on the back side. When you finish the first pallet, you took the pull the last case out that first that first pallet. You got to pull it out, put it on the floor, put it in the in the bin, put it in a pallet slot. Now he working the second the front pallet. See, working the front pallet now. No, 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 no. You should work both pallets evenly. And that's not what he did. This is amateur. This amateur work. He, he filled the back pallet first, and now he's trying to fill the front pallet. No, nah, you should have filled both pallets evenly. That's what you should have did. I don't know how many times he walked around. He jumped off on this side, walk around. This this has to be. This is not this is not a front stand up lift. This is a, a lift where you uh, you can walk into it and drive it. There's some lifts where you use your left hand and you're holding on like this. Where you're leading, and then there's other lifts where you kind of like ride like a motorbike. This is a lift where you kind of like ride like a motorbike. Ready. Look, look, look. That shit about almost fell. That top almost fell. Because he ain't got it tied in. He ain't got it tied in with the nothing. Still not tying it in. He's got one, two, three. This is a three pallet jack. I've never seen those before. I've always worked with two pallet jacks. Crossing this, crossing this jack again. Crossing this pallet. Picking on this side, dropping it off on this side. That's a waste of time, man. Pick on this side, drop on that side. And this dude would never beat me in the pick. Right now, if you ask me, if you ask me, he running less than 100% right now. He'll never make incentive. He'll never bring home bonus. If he pull, if he pull like this all day long, he, he going to lose his job the first, first two weeks. Because this ain't even 95%. It took him 20 minutes to pick about 60 cases. It's your barber's dog, man. This is all I'm going to teach y'all for now. I'll make more videos like this later. Peace out, man. This dude is garbage.